Okay, so in this video we're going to talk about waste material and how you can actually manage that because there obviously is always going to be waste, you'll get cut off, you'll get broken items, So, but you should still account for that so that you can manage your inventory properly. So if we go to the pieces, the easiest way really to do this, um, go into your pieces section, if you add a new, and we'll just call this one waste. Okay. Now you can be uh, as creative as you like with this if you have waste for particular things. So you may have waste for beads, you may have waste for clay, you may have waste for string. Um, if you feel the need to actually categorize that into different areas, you can. So you could call this um, uh, waste uh, string, for example, or waste clay, or whatever it might be, um, and then apply this so that you actually have individual waste um, records. Um, this example here, I'm just gonna show if we just do this as one then it's simple for the example. So we'll call this uh, we'll call this waste, and I'll just add in a category for it as waste. And say OK. Let's click that. OK, I don't need to worry about sizes and weights and stuff like that. But it's as simple as um, if you have any cutoff, then in the same way as you create a regular piece, just add that cutoff into here. So if we were to, oh, sorry, we just need to add a number of pieces just one one piece made so if we were just to add any time we had some um, uh, some throwaway so if we had a bit of clay that we didn't end up using and you had a, a volume or a weight for that you could just put that in here and just say that was a waste amount there for that or you could add in You may have had a, a magnetic clasp, for example. Let's say one of those got bent and broken, you couldn't use it anymore. You can put that in here. So that way all this stuff is recorded because this can all be um, useful information for tax write-offs. Um, so you know that this stuff is not valuable anymore. You can't sell it, you can't use it. Um, so recording your waste material can actually be a very good thing to do. Um, take that information to your accountant and this is all tax write-off information that you need for your tax records.